Hey everybody, how you doing? It's Oz with Tow Trucks, Cars, and Energy Drinks, and I got a great one for you guys. So basically, you know, as a smaller tow company, we kind of get the little bottom feeder, you know, stuff uh, that the big motor clubs and stuff, they don't want to give us all the good calls. They kind of just give us the scraps. We all know that. And uh, so they called me a specific motor club, and you know me, I don't really bash people or motor clubs or anything. I don't ever get into that stuff, not yet. I'm waiting for all that. And uh, if you notice, if you know, you follow and watch my videos, I don't ever, ever, ever touch on motor clubs. Uh, but there's good reason why. But anyway, um, I got this call and it was from the motor club and they're like, hey, you know, is this, uh, you know, Oz and everything. I was like, yeah, they're like, okay, we need you to do this tow. And uh, we've sent five tow trucks out there and we can't get it. You know, the, it's a clearance issue, I guess. So um, that's why I bought a wheel lift truck because they have better clearance and you can get in tighter spots and this is exactly what I'm talking about right there so the marked clearance on this uh, on these pylons or whatever the heck you call them is um, right there it says no more than seven uh, seven feet clearance and then there's the car on the back and um, they said no more than seven feet clearance and uh, I actually looked up the clearance on the Dodge website and it says it's six feet nine inches for the clearance and um, I was mad because I'm like, man, I'm going to go all the way out there and I'm not going to be able to get it. I brought all my equipment and everything because the price they wanted to pay me for this tow is a lot. Probably three times to four times almost what they char what I charge for a normal tow. Like they absolutely needed this car to get towed. And look, look at the clearance. I barely just cleared it. And um, a lot of times when you do this like that, um, these things actually kind of will go up a little bit. So even if it hit a little bit, it's fine because they kind of move up some, you know what I'm saying? And uh, I was prepared to take my light bar off if I needed to because I, I really, how much they paid me to do this tow, um, you know what I'm saying? I wasn't going to turn it down. I was going to at least investigate at the minimum, at least get the GOA. So that just goes to show you guys, you got to try. Don't give up so early. Always remember, worst case scenario, you're going to get the GOA, you know, for the attempt. And uh, I'm just really happy and I wanted to shoot this video because, you know, it's been a really rough week and um, I thought this call was just going to be a nightmare and this was actually probably the easiest call I did all week and it by far probably paid me the most for the time that it's going to take me. This car is going to go like four miles and uh, I'll probably make a little bit more over than $250 for towing this car just a couple miles. So as you can see, um, that's the car right there. And um, obviously I couldn't get it on the rollback because then it would put it up all the way up there, but there it is right there. So just remember, man, you don't, if you don't try, if you don't swing, you can't hit. So uh, just wanted to share that with you guys. I'll be posting some more videos this week. We just hit 400 subscribers. I'm very, very thankful for everybody. Um, at this point, you know, we started out, uh, I'm still at nothing, you know, 400 uh, subscribers is nothing, but I'm grateful for every subscriber, you know, that I'm involved with. You know, I love answering your guys' questions and, and just being a part of the towing community in general. So, as always, please like and subscribe. Oswald, Oz, whatever you want to call me, tow trucks, cars, energy, drinks, out, GT out.